Hello again, everyone, and uh, this is uh, Sean. I'm uh, back with you for um, Spiral Dynamics Stage Blue. Uh, this is a part of my uh, Spiral Dynamics series um, to um, basically define what uh, Spiral Dynamics is. If you're new to it, basically, um, it's a uh, scale representing uh, psychological and uh, spiritual uh, progress in oneself or um, in any uh, civilization or uh, country. So uh, I'll just give you the uh, basic rundown of uh, all the colors. Um, we've got beige, the most basic level, and then we got uh, purple, and then red, and then blue, which will be the uh, focus of uh, this v particular video. And then after blue, we've got orange, and then green, and then th those are uh, all the uh, colors uh, at the uh, first tier. And uh, at the second tier, uh, we've got uh, yellow and then uh, capping off the entire spiral uh, turquoise. But our main uh, focus uh, on the agenda today is uh, stage blue. Now, uh, what uh, exactly uh, constitutes um, Spiral Dynamic Stage Blue. Well, um, having emerged from uh, the chaos of Stage Red, we can now uh, expect to see uh, law and order, uh, discipline, uh, duty to uh, one's uh, country, to uh, one's uh, civilization, uh, and um, the beginnings of um, a strong, solid uh, civilization. It's uh, from here that uh, uh, one uh, puts uh, emphasis on uh, discipline, duty, uh, hard work, um, a life purpose, a life meaning uh, greater than uh, oneself, um, and uh, to instill uh, this uh, discipline and uh, good behavior, uh, religion uh, comes into uh, the forefront, the uh, circle. Um, this is where um, uh, religions uh, like Christianity, Islam, Judaism, uh, Buddhism uh, emerge. So when did uh, Spiral Dynamic Stage Blue emerge? Well, it emerged around uh, 5,000 years ago when uh, man started to uh, cultivate uh, lands uh, to uh, graze uh, crops, to um, raise cattle. Um, this uh, was a very uh, effective way at uh, sustaining uh, populations and uh, raising and making them grow even further. Um, it, it's often said that uh, women uh, stay at home to uh, do all the uh, chores while the men go out to do all the fighting. Uh, that's uh, more relevant in uh, stage red. However, state, with stage blue, uh, you can uh, expect, to, expect to encounter a very uh, patriarchal uh, society where uh, men are uh, more privileged and uh, men have basically have more uh, power and authority over women. Um, men uh, have more under stage blue uh, will have more um, uh, tendencies to um, better themselves through uh, education, through uh, hard work, estate, uh, attaining uh, positions of leadership and power. Um, now, um, since stage blue um, it emphasizes uh, stability and order, um, leaders uh, more or less are um, generally uh, well uh, established. Uh, they don't uh, necessarily arise uh, out of uh, chaos and violence like we uh, do see in red. Um, rather, it's more um, patriarchal, as in a monarchy. Um, monarchies uh, as an institution are uh, ruled by uh, stage blue. And um, when um, when uh, a new civilization emerges, there's a dominant family that uh, uh, takes on the uh, roles of uh, the royal family. 
Um, we've got uh, dukes, uh, princes, kings, queens, uh, princesses. Um, these are all uh, uh, emerging uh, from blue. And um, whenever a, a king or queen uh, passes on, they uh, naturally uh, select uh, their eldest to uh, the, the next uh, person in line to uh, be the uh, heirs to the uh, throne. So that's uh, very uh, typical of uh, stage blue. And um, one um, can, uh, there's much uh, patriotism uh, at this stage. When uh, civilizations emerge, uh, nations emerge from uh, uh, tribes, from uh, all these uh, tribalism uh, societies, um, a, a civilization uh, can uh, grow to be uh, far larger than uh, the realms of uh, what uh, tribes can um, take over. Uh, so um, these uh, civilizations can be uh, pretty large. Um, we uh, see uh, stage blue uh, very active among uh, 45 to 55 percent of the uh, world's population today. So uh, it's still uh, quite a uh, relevant stage for these uh, current times. Um, it's uh, very uh, relevant in the uh, Midwestern uh, United States. Um, I would say that, that uh, the Canadian province of Alberta is a very uh, spiral dynamics uh, stage blue. Um, the uh, the uh, political uh, ideology of uh, conservatism, uh, of order, uh, out of chaos, stability, and uh, security, uh, that uh, is a, that uh, is uh, derived from uh, stage blue. Uh, that is a part of a stage blue, I should say. Um, many uh, societies uh, in Africa are uh, currently uh, emerging out of red into blue with the uh, rise of uh, traditional uh, religions. Um, I, I would say um, even uh, in uh, emerging China, we uh, have the uh, Chinese government uh, still trying to uh, impose uh, authority and control amongst the uh, general population. Even though um, China is becoming uh, much more advanced uh, technologically and uh, ecologically, um, with um, stage orange uh, coming into play there, um, China is still a very much a uh, stage blue society uh, with um, communism um, ruling over um, all of the uh, lives of the uh, Chinese people. Um, yes, um, communism, that uh, actually would fall under a stage blue, even though we like to think of uh, communi communism under, uh, falling under um, the red color, uh, it, it uh, actually uh, falls under blue because of uh, the authoritarian uh, control uh, that uh, is brought down amongst uh, people living in those uh, societies. So, um, yes, uh, some uh, of the uh, key concepts are um, you um, do uh, what is right uh, onto others as you do onto yourself. Um, you uh, must be ready to uh, sacrifice your uh, happiness for the uh, greater good. Um, you must uh, obey the uh, laws at uh, all costs or otherwise you will face the most uh, severe uh, punishment. Um, attending uh, church every uh, Sunday is uh, mandatory uh, or uh, very, very important to uh, your well-being. 
um, the uh, greater good of society is uh, much more important than your own uh, personal happiness. So stage blue, it's a very uh, we-centered uh, stage, whereas uh, like beige or um, red or orange or yellow, those are very uh, egocentric or me-centered um, uh, stages. However, uh, with uh, blue, uh, you're uh, not so much concerned with your uh, own personal needs, but rather the needs of uh, the uh, of your country and civilization at large. So um, it's um, it's uh, obvious to uh, scholars of the spiral dynamics how uh, patriots uh, would fall under uh, this color. Um, compulsory uh, military service that uh, would fall under uh, stage blue. Um, right, again, uh, with the emphasis of uh, sacrificing uh, oneself to your uh, nation, um, taking one uh, for the team, that's a mantra of falling under stage blue. Um, expressions like, uh, oh Canada, uh, God bless America, rural Britannia, uh, those would uh, be very uh, char characteristic of uh, Spiral Dynamic Stage Blue. Um, so there's a lot of uh, rigidity and uh, authority um, through this uh, color. Um, I can uh, think of um, certain people who would uh, fall uh, into um, this this color, uh, former U.S. Uh, president, former U.S. Vice President, rather uh, Mike Pence, uh, with his uh, evangelical Christian uh, views, uh, he uh, would be considered to be a very stage blue person. Uh, former Canadian uh, Prime Minister Stephen Harper, with his uh, rigid um, authoritarian. Uh, like manner of uh, how he handled uh, Parliament, uh, Canadian Parliament, and um, the economy, uh, he would be a very uh, stage blue uh, individual. Um, priests, rabbis, um, Bible preachers, those who uh, preach the Bible uh, as the uh, literal word of uh, absolute truth, that uh, would be a very uh, stage blue uh, concept. Um, at, it's at, at this stage that uh, absolute uh, truth cannot be questioned. Um, whether it's uh, read from uh, the Bible, the Quran, or the uh, Torah, um, it cannot be uh, altered, changed, but it can be written down. And um, for what uh, one reads from there uh, what one uh, basically believes and uh, accepts. He's stage uh, blue people, in my opinion, uh, they're not uh, open-minded enough to uh, question uh, these truths. Um, they're um, very um, rigid when it comes to uh, sexuality. Um, they do not want to um, talk about uh, sex openly. Um, they feel uh, that it's uh, quite a sin to do that. Um, stage blue uh, demonizes uh, homosexuality as well. Um, yes, so um, very uh, rigid in uh, beliefs. Um, one uh, at stage blue, uh, once uh, one has uh, established uh, their beliefs, it's very hard for them to um, be uh, open-minded, to uh, be op open to uh, new beliefs. Uh, basically, um, b the beliefs that uh, a person at stage blue has will be with them for the rest of their lives. So, um, yes. Um, what else can I uh, 
say about uh, stage blue. Um, I would say uh, Saudi Arabia with um, its extreme uh, ways of how uh, the country imposes uh, Islam amongst um, its uh, citizenry um, to the extreme, that would be uh, stage blue. Um, yes, uh, several uh, Mid Middle Eastern uh, countries, um, the church uh, in general, that would uh, fall under a stage blue. Um, strict morals, um, uh, the Ten Commandments, um, what uh, is being uh, preached at uh, Sunday service at Mass, uh, Catholicism, um, yes, um, basically uh, any uh, traditional religion that would be fall under this uh, stage of the spiral. Uh, some other examples I can think of are um, the Vatican, uh, the Pope, um, the uh, pilgrimage that um, Muslims uh, go to in uh, Saudi Arabia uh, once during their uh, lifetimes. Um, yes, uh, just um, strong adherence to uh, religion and faith. Now, um, I would say that uh, when uh, somebody uh, commits a crime, uh, somebody, uh, the people at stage blue would not uh, give any uh, compassion to the criminal. Uh, they would see to it that uh, he deserves the uh, harshest punishment. Um, and uh, these people would uh, strongly uh, favor, favor the uh, death penalty. Um, say if a criminal commits murder. Um, yes, so, um, yeah, at times blue can be a very uh, inflexible and uh, stubborn. Um, however, um, most uh, people at uh, stage blue, they can be uh, very uh, down to earth. Um, they can be, they're, they're very hardworking and uh, decent people. So, um, yes, we must uh, give credit in that regard. Um, yes, so um, stage uh, blue, yeah. Um, when uh, when uh, the late stages of uh, blue emerge, uh, we can... Uh, see uh, individuals uh, starting to question uh, the faiths that uh, they've been uh, following uh, their whole lives. They're starting to uh, open up their minds. Um, they're starting to, um, you know, demand a little more uh, freedom in their uh, personal lives. They want to become more uh, successful. They want to earn more money. Um, they want to earn the, they want to uh, start their own uh, businesses and corporations. Uh, this is where orange uh, comes into play uh, when uh, the uh, excesses of uh, stage blue become uh, overwhelmingly apparent. Um, yes, uh, I would say um, wars, um, many wars uh, through in, in, throughout history have been uh, based on uh, um, the expansion of a civilization and uh, religion. For example, the uh, Crusades, um, the First and Second World Wars, um, I would say the uh, Viet Vietnamese, the war in Vietnam with uh, Viet North Vietnam uh, overtaking the South uh, with their imposing their uh, communist ideologies on the rest of, on the uh, southern part. Uh, yeah, that would be a characteristic of stage blue. Um, yes. Um, 
basically that to those are uh, what I've uh, mentioned um, uh, is uh, very is quite uh, evident among um, circuma- circumstances at uh, stage blue. Sorry, I'm just uh, rambling on here, but um, yeah, it's uh, nation building, um, the uh, expansion of a civilization. Um, quite often, um, people at stage blue would uh, like to assume that their country is uh, superior to uh, other countries. Their uh, the country that they're living is that they live in is the best. It's the most uh, superior in the world. It's either uh, you come to enjoy my civilization or enjoy no civilization at all. And uh, say if uh, one is a Christian at uh, stage blue, um, they would uh, like to think that uh, Christianity would be uh, superior to Islam or to Buddhism or um, Say if somebody at stage blue was a, was a Muslim, they would think otherwise. Um, that Muslim is superior to um, Christianity or it's the one true faith. So, um, yeah, there. Even though um, blue um, uh, values uh, stability, order, and uh, peace, well, it can. Uh, Go to war if uh, if it feels it's uh, being threatened by um, any other uh, stage on the spiral. Um, yes, it's just a, a radical uh, defense of uh, rigid beliefs, and yeah. So I think um, I've just uh, covered uh, the most uh, basic uh, concepts of. Uh, stage blue and um yeah one other uh tidbit i can think of uh if you another example of stage blue thinking is if you uh don't uh, believe in the lord then you deserve to be uh cast down to hell um yes um right and wrong are absolute uh, con concepts um, it doesn't occur to um, someone at stage blue that uh, these are just uh, constructs of the uh, human mind. Um, yes. Uh, mm-hmm. So, um, I, that's all I can uh, say at this point about stage blue. Um, if you want to... Uh, learn more about uh, this uh, stage on the uh, spiral, I do um, encourage you to uh, check out other uh, videos, other perspectives on uh, YouTube. And uh, I uh, have to give credit credit to uh, Don Beck and Claire Graves, the uh, two uh, psychologists who uh, created Spiral Dynamics, who've brought um, insight um, into um, much of uh, human consciousness and the history and inspired uh, many uh, people around the world to uh, grow spiritually and psychologically. And I also give credit to Elvio Gura of Actualize.org who uh, has created a uh, series of uh, Spiral Dynamics which uh, I've uh, watched every single episode from. So kudos to you as well, Leo. So, um, yep, that's it uh, in a nutshell. Um, this is uh, Sean, and um, I do thank you for watching, and um, I uh, will have more uh, content about uh, stages orange, green, uh, yellow, and uh, turquoise in the future. Okay, so thank you for watching. Have a wonderful day. Take care. Thank you.